In this video, I'm going to show you an easy way to make a model of DNA. Very inexpensive, too. I just used a couple of household items here, a bunch of Q-tips that you can see there. I picked out four different colored markers, one marker to code each of the four nucleotide bases that make up the DNA sequence. And then I'm also going to use a little bit of duct tape. So right now what I'm doing in the video is I'm just coding or coloring, I should say, my Q-tips to match up those four different nucleotide bases, adenine, thymine, cytosine, and guanine. Coloring the Q-tips is probably going to be the thing that takes you the longest to do in this whole project. But believe it or not, I got this entire project done in less than 35 minutes start to finish. Right now, I'm color coding for the cyanine, uh, yeah, cytosine and guanine. Um, now I have all my Q-tips laid out, and I actually figured out how to lay them out, how to sequence those, based on that picture that you see on the computer right there. So I just kind of matched up that to the picture that was on the computer. Now I take my duct tape, and I lay it out, start attaching those Q-tips to that end of the duct tape, fold it over, seal it up, do the same thing on the other side, and then I'm almost done. All I have to do is trim off the ends, give it a little twist to make my double helix, and in less than 35 minutes, I'm done with my model. 